All right, guys, this is Ray here at Jeeps Unlimited. I'm going to be showing you a 97 to 02 uh, Jeep Wrangler four cylinder frame, uh, the 2.5 liters. This guy is uh, very clean, has some oxidation on it. Um, wouldn't even say that, just where the paint peeled off, uh, just some where the bare metal is. Uh, you can just see that a little bit, but it's in very good shape. Uh, no rust, not wrecked. Um, they didn't come from a wrecked Jeep, it was a running and driving Jeep that it was pulled from. Everything's in really good shape. The buckets are really nice, as you can see there. Um, this is the underside rear. This is where the control arm uh, mount is for the rear. And uh, you can kind of look in there. I don't know if you can see very well in there. But yeah, very, very clean, no rust. And uh, here's the other control arm, and try to see well in there as well. No rust. Um, and uh, let me get this boot up on this side. And. So you guys underneath this bucket. Very clean, no rust under the buckets. Um, this guy's very solid. Uh, some of the paint is peeled off, so you do see uh, some of the bare metal on here, which is very common. Um, here's where the transmission mounts are. Uh, obviously, water gets trapped between there, so it causes some oxidation. But very solid, uh, no rust, no broken bolts. Um, here's the front control arm and there's the shock tower and here's the front part of the the frame on the underside that's where the grill mounts nice and solid mount um, there was a a broken bolt there from the bumper uh, let me get out of the sun and same on that side but those are sticking out so they're got enough tread on them to get extracted fairly easy if you got some good set of extractors and uh, there's the front shock tower and the other control arm mount and then go to the other side again water likes to get trapped here so there's some oxidation from the bare metal um, but no rust very solid and uh, I'll flip it over so you guys can see the top side so we'll start from the back of the Jeep Again, very clean, no rust. Uh, that's some dirt from the water that happens after we wash them. And uh, there's the top side of the buckets. They're very clean. This is the mortar mount there. And here's the shock tower. Again, some oxidation from the bare metal um, in some spots, but no rust. We've got some jets flying above us, so it might be a little noisy. And here's the other shock tower. Very clean. And here's the rear coil spring bucket for the top driver's side. Again, there's uh, some metal that's uh, showing a little bit from the paint, not being from the paint wearing away, so you'll see some uh, oxidation there, but very clean, rust-free, 9702 Jeep Wrangler frame. Uh, it is 2.5 liter. Um, I do have 4.0s as well, and CJs and TJs, and many other frames and tubs. So uh, my name is Ray. I'm probably going to be the guy you guys are talking to when you call for this part or anything else. And uh, yeah, I can answer any questions you have. And uh, here's a detailed photo, photo or video of the frame you guys will be buying from us. Thanks.